You know, I've been meaning to get a video out soon, but honestly, I've just been really, really busy. Like, really busy. No, he didn't. I did not see that coming. Wait, what was I supposed to do again? Oh yeah, make a video. Sorry about that. Ugh. People have done these before! I need to think about something that no one has ever done before in the history of ever. Today we're going to look at several alterations of the game Snake, the game that is highly associated with Nokia cell phones. Too bad I have a Samsung. I guess I can't play it then. Thanks, Obama. Well, what you may not know is that the snake design dates back to Gremlins 1979. No! No, 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 no! 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 Now where was I? Oh, Gremlins 1979 arcade game Blockade. Another game that took this unique concept is the 1982 arcade game Tron. The player guides a blue light cycle in an arena against an opponent, while still avoiding the walls and trails of light left behind by both light cycles. Tron actually became so popular that it eventually led to snake games sometimes being called Tron or light cycle games. The whole idea behind Snake is that the player controls a line or dot on a bordered plane. As it moves forward and eats pellets, it leaves a trail behind, resembling a snake getting longer and longer. The player then loses when the snake runs into the screen border or its own trail. The latest adaptation of the classic Snake game is a 2016 online browser game titled Slither.io. In this game, players control a snake-like avatar, which consumes multicolored pellets in a game to grow in size. The objective of the game is to grow the longest snake in the server, but if the player collides into a part of another snake, the player loses the game and must start over. The defeated avatar's body turns into bright, shining dots for other players to consume. Overall, the snake reflects the human characteristic of never being satisfied. We always want more because we feel like that will make us happy, to the point where that we have so much in excess that we end up hurting ourselves. Wait a minute. I'm the snake. 